folks, welcome back to Red Faction Gr Gorilla Remastered. Remastered Edition. Yep. So, we're back to this. Uh, yes. That looks like a. Oh, is it just painted red? I thought it was just rusty. No, no. You see the proper rusty vehicles in the second uh, area. Uh, just remind, it just reminds me of um, Jack, well, not Jack and Dexter Free, it's just called Jack Free, where you had the um, big desert vehicles. Yeah. Some of them are really, really fun, but to unlock them all is a bit of a pain. Yeah. Okay, let's go to mission briefing. Um. Why is it in any like game you play with vehicles? You can't drive like you would normally. Well, in this case, I am driving under one third gravity. This is true. No, to start like, with. When I was playing Simpsons and running at normal, I was trying my best to obey the laws, and no matter what I did, the, the vehicle would just start veering off to the left oh, or right yeah. lanes. But she shouldn't have gone alone. After what happened at the old base, I'm not taking chances. Get to Sam as soon as you can. Yep. Sure thing. Okie dokie. Sure thing, boss man. Say it, Edith. Your commander. It's a trap! It's a trap! That's a trap! Okay, what guns do I bring with me? Well, that was that was it. That was not too far away. Yeah, well. Yeah, who needs accuracy when you can run up to them and shoot them in the face? I couldn't tell which one were which, I like, I just I, I figured that um, you killed them eventually because you were the only one like, you know, uh, follow Sam to the ambush point. Ooh. Ammo. Aww, not salvage. Ammo. Ooh. Are you trying to bomb the um, bridge down? Oh, I can do that easily. See? But the bridge is there. Yeah, I know. But the bridge, is, but they're coming in under the bridge. Oh. So really, what, I, what I'm doing is standing here and waiting for them to drive in. Oh, okay. Although since it does say prepare for, so I suppose what I should be doing is getting my bombs. Yeah. And just dropping a few in the air, even. Although, since they come in several waves, there's not really much point to it. And I can also only place three of my bombs at once. No, oh, fair enough. Yeah, but anything that explodes like that thing did yeah. gives you a heap of salvage when it does so. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Zero. I am. I'm stood right in front of the <laughs> where they're going to be driving in. Here they come. You're low on health. Yes, I know. Cover. You just hide here sucking my thumb while my health regenerates? Oh, it's one of those ones where your health magically regenerates. Yes. Because, of course, getting shot in the, the stomach three times, you can still just you can do that. I believe it on magical motion nanotech. I would say we're not exactly starfish. Well, he could be. I mean, no one else seems to be able to regenerate like that. Fair enough. 
That was close. What the fuck? You nearly died. Yes. Definitely gonna go buy some armor from Sam before the final mission of this sector. Oh. Uh, oh yeah, an EDF car blew up. Even more money for me. <laughs> Although, let's see, to unlock the final mission I need to drop the control down to zero. Oh, okay. And I do that. Uh, there's some mission, some of the cell side missions that can do it, or I could just go blow up their stuff. I, 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 I like go and blow up their stuff. Yes. But before I can do that, I'm gonna need a decent car. So let's go get one. I said a decent car. <laughs> uh, or alternatively, I could just start running back to the base until one appears. That usually works. Mm -hmm. The only other alternative being go die and respawn back at the base. <laughs> which would drop the morale of the entire sector. Yeah. Hey, you see this thing? Yeah. See that bucket at the back? Yeah. How many troops do you think you'd be able to carry in such a thing? Yeah. Twelve? Yep. Yeah. Uh, guess again. You Twen can fit two. Re what? What? Ha! It's the same way you can fit in one of these. Yeah, that makes sense. Mm. Yeah, well, the, the, your troops are the, the, the guerrilla troops you can carry in are only comfortable if they're sat on the, uh, oh, what's it called? The wheel wells, I think? Oh, you know, you know, yeah. You know, where, where, where the, 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 not wheel wells, wheel archers. Yeah, I, I know what you're about. Yeah. Otherwise, they won't ride. Despite the fact that they're Oops. guerrilla fighters and they should be used to hardship, especially given where they live. Yeah. Okay, Sam. Uh, oh, you don't have armor. Why do you not have armor? You are. Oh well. I thought I said arc reactor and all that. Okay. Since when do we add Iron Man stuff in there? No, the arc welder is the best thing for stealing cars. Ah. And it's the own, as far as I know, unless except for the missions where you're given a tank, which are all very late game. If you encounter a tank in the wild, the arc welder is, to my knowledge, the only way of stealing it without, of, of, of you know, getting it for yourself. Fair enough. All other ways are just blow it up. Okay, so go here, blow stuff up. First, demolish this. Propaganda destroyed. Yep. Isn't that yours so far? No, that's theirs. Oh. Oopsie. Oh well, I just ran over a soldier. Run away! Oh no, there's a yellow alert! Okay, here is... <laughs> okay, you know, you know. Just, have no disregard for safety, just drive into them. Well, they're the bad guys. Oh, I'm, I'm allowed I'm, to do that. I thought this, the, the, this were like some of your guys that you just completely... You know, just no, you can tell they're the bad guys because of their, their uniforms. Anyway. Yeah, just like, let's kick his corpse over as well. Why not? They do the same to us. This is true. Okay, so, give me the bombs. You can have one strapped to your knee. Sticky bomb. Okay, where's that guy shooting at me? Oh look, he's not there anymore. Oh no, there he's he is. still there. <laughs> no, he isn't. Okay, and... There's one over there. You got something on your head. Yeah. There's something on your face! It was gay! It was a bomb! <laughs> uh... Oh. Oh. That guy was shooting at me. And then I dropped a building on him. After I blew him up. That guy is still shooting at me. I think there's several of them. Okay, uh, running low on bombs. How's the sector control look? Okay.
Okay. I think I'm not going to get out of this alive. Wee! Yeah. He's going for a nice flight, though. Oh, well. Continue. Is this stuff still destroyed, or do you have to do it Oh, again? yeah, the stuff's still destroyed. Once you destroy something, it stays destroyed until you get the reconstructor. Oh, fair enough. Which is a post-game item. Oh. And it has the magical power of restoring everything that you blew up. Ah, uh, so you can get more salvage, I'm guessing. No, it doesn't restore the salvage, it's just like... I mean, in the Badlands, the third sector you unlock... Well, technically you unlock it at the same time as Dust. But I think of it as the third sector because it's further along. Yeah. Oh, no, no, sorry, I'm getting mixed up. You unlock it at the same time as Oasis, which is on the other side of it. So, it's the, so it, you know, goes yeah. sort of linear-like. But... In there, in the middle of there, there's a big, massive bridge, the such, uh, I can't remember the name, the Memorial Bridge, that you can blow up for masses of salvage and loss of EDF uh, property, da you know, massive EDF property damage. But it also happens to be the big bridge right through the middle of the Badlands. Fair enough. So if you blow it up, so, you've got to build it back up. Yeah, yeah, once you've blown it up, you can rebuild it with the Reconstructor. Post game. Fair enough. Well, at least in the uh, regular Steam version of this, you can. Not so sure about this version, not having assume, completed it. I'd assume, I'd assume you, it's the same. Yeah. But then again, the Reconstructor, as far as I know, wasn't in the Xbox 360 version at all. Was it not? Well, I never saw it in there. Ooh, thingies that blow up. Is that people that blow up or just finger thingies? Things. If it was people, I'd say pitiful enemy soldiers that blow up. Okay, uh... Where's that? Oh, there it is, of course. Ooh, soldiers! Ooh, EDF assault. Run! Run away! No, run towards. Right, and shoot, blow, blow up. Yeah, the EDF are coming to uh, are coming to uh, take down what's supposed to be a stronghold of the gorillas. So I'm going to go defend it. It lowers their control. It improves our morale. Fair enough. Up and over and yep, assault. Defend the gorilla location. And as such, I will go up here. Oh, the high. Snipe. I said the high ground. It's over, Anakin! I have the high ground! Oh, no, shit. I, don't, I no. think you have the lava ground. Uh, mm. Hammer. I can't snipe. I can't snipe in these conditions. That is a bit dusty, isn't it? No, I was referring to the fact that there was a wall in the way. Oh, fair enough. Which I then removed. Mm -hmm. Yes, you'll note this nice cutting hole I cut in the wall. <laughs> yes. Very Cunning. unobtrusive. They'll never guess I'm sniping from up here. Where are they? Oh, there they are. Okay, I've solved this. I Give me the pistol. You. Yes, well, kind of. Until They're we regrouping. Get Until they get another tr tr truck coming. Yeah. And despite the pistol being generally not a very good weapon, comparative, I think in this situation it might, it might be much better, especially since I haven't got a sniper rifle yet. Yeah. I mean, you can do headshots with it. That's exactly. You can do snap shooting, which you can't do with the assault rifle. Okay, uh, is there someone still hiding behind that? Or is everyone just shooting it because they can? Oh. Guerrilla action complete. There was. Yeah, and then, and then there wasn't. 
Okay, to the house arrest. That should lower control. Yep, down to where I need it to be. But for yeah. a house arrest mission, I'm going to take one of these. So you're going to take the uh, what they just give to you, basically. Yeah, I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this thing. This, this should have enough capacity for either one or two dudes, which is what I need. Okay, uh, but since I'm actually charging into battle this time, instead of defending, I want my assault rifle. Yo, talk to me. Just one person. Um, okay, that could be a problem. What? There's an the interrogation unit on the second level of the Sand Sifters' plan. That's that place I just went and blew up. But there's nothing there. Yeah, exactly. How am I going to get to the second floor when there isn't a second floor? And more importantly, how's that guy, how's that guy going to be on the second floor when there isn't a second floor? Maybe it's a glitch in the game, or...? No, it, the, I'm, sure, I'm sure the guy will just be there and somehow be miraculously alive despite me... Oh no, no, sorry, it's a similar, identical building. Oh. See? But not the same one, as I can, as you can tell by the lack of lots and lots of... Um, debris? Debris and smokestacks. I'm told you just have to blow this one up, though. Yep, let me just uh, untie dude and, and rest for the rest of my health. Take hostages to safe house. Oh, good. Random, random gorilla appears. Okay, we'll take your car instead. <laughs> Yo, random hostage dude, get in. I need you to be on the turret while I um, attempt to get out of here. Um, attempt. Yeah, it's attempt. There's a three car pile up. Yeah, not very far to the safe house. Yes, I didn't see me far from the ambush place. Yeah. Get out of the car. Complete. Mission unlocked. Oh, and oh yeah, the ore attitude. We need your help. I hope you're a good driver. Okay, give me the ore additive. I needs it. What's that one do? Basically there's the ore deposit, which are these big black spiky things. Yeah. There's one literally just outside the... the uh, safe house. Yeah, you see, see that thing there? Oh yeah. Yeah, that's, that, that's the ore deposit. It's full of salvage. But you need the... Um, but, well, you can get it as it is, but it's worth twice as much if you have the ore additive. Oh, fair enough. That's why, well, well among other among reasons why I haven't, why I didn't demolish it. Anyway, how, how we do? We have enough we time for yeah, the. We've got about another ten minutes. Okay, in that case, let's go. You kick the EDF that. out of Parker. I hope you're a good driver. Well, you are kind of. I'm the best driver on Mars. Everyone gets out of my way. Yeah, because you just go, ah, uh, move. Uh, well, well, in this case, it's because I'm driving an EDF van, and everyone gets out of their way anyway. But I was not thinking like it's a senior driving in here. You, your style is move or be moved. Yeah. Okay. Da -da -da -da. Move in the dust. <laughs> a diversion. Yep. Pretty simple. Go along this route, demolish all the towers. Yep. Sure. Ah, yeah, they've got this special car for me. We reinforced it with arm. Oh, fair enough. God damn it, I missed. Oh well. What are you aiming for? That tower. 
Yeah. See these ones that have the, the big flashy arrows pointing oh, at them? Oh, you've got to destroy I've them. Got to de I've got to demolish all of them. Not in any particular order, but I just have to get all of them. Okay, four of twelve. I mean, obviously, you know, with the, with the um, well, EDF basically being so close to the surface, you'd think they'd just walk around and eventually find it, sure. Yeah, well, I mean, how some of the safe houses are, quote, disguised is completely ridiculous. I mean, in one case, it's act they actually kind of uh, lampshade that with the. Uh, I think it's in one of the Oasis safe houses. Yeah. You know, you know, the, the, one of the guerrilla actions is defend against attacking EDF. You know, the one, the one I just did. Yeah. Before the house arrest one. Yeah, that one has go to this location, defend it against the EDF. The location is the actual safe house. Seriously. Yes, and that's and that and that's one of the safe houses that I would say charitably is better hidden. But yeah, they they they, look, they can't find the ones that are right around the corner from me. Yeah. As bad as like you know the how I mean I mean all this, no, I mean technically I think just from a view viewable viewableness standpoint so to speak I'm not sure of the exact word I'm looking for aesthetic no um, how easy it would be to see okay um, given that this is the EDF and they have control of all of Marsh Martian airspace and space space yeah so to speak. The easiest ones to be not seen are the, are the ones that are in caves. Yeah. And admittedly, they, 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 they never find those. But that being the case, why aren't more of them in caves? Yeah, I mean, well, uh, to be fair, it's like, I suppose it's like... <laughs> did he just break he just his own... He just broke his own tower, yes. I suppose it's like the um, Team Rocket Ash Captain like kind of thing. Yeah. You know how they're all, he, he sees them every day. They're always disguised. Surely by at least, you know, yeah. now he should be able to recognise the disguise, and yet he doesn't. I mean, it's yeah, obvious well. it's them. Yes. Morale bonus, total salvage, 114. Parker liberated. And control down to zero. Control down to zero, rocket launcher unlocked. Armour unlocked, maybe? Because you said you needed armour. Armour, yeah, you unlock the level one armour at this point. Okay. Good. So I'll help to drive them out. Yes. It's where all the mines are. Ah. And all the and most of the refineries. Yeah, you see, there's the car that was reinforced with armor. I haven't seen that safe. Yeah, it blew up just before I managed to get to the final tower. Luckily, I have bombs. Yeah. Okay. Uh, however, now I'm in the middle of hell knows where. There's my safe. There's the. S yeah, there's a mission. There's a mission. There's a safe house. And there's a wind farm! So, and that's all the thing you've got to destroy? The, uh, the things I can destroy. Also, th there's a few others that, which are the high priority targets, which aren't marked until you actually find them. Oh, fair enough. Uh, run, 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 run. I say, you've probably got just not enough time to get to the safe house. If I can find a road, yes. Well, there is that. I mean, I'm, I'm literally currently just legging it through the wilderness of Mars. Yeah, shoot him. Sorry, not you, this... Did you, did you just get a notification of some kind? Yeah, saying, go to bed a road. in 15 minutes and you'll have 9 Ooh. hours of sleep. 9 hours of sleep. It's something I've started doing for work. What, get, try, trying to get 9 hours trying of sleep? Trying to get enough sleep in, in general. Halt! I claim your vehicle in the name of the faction. Thank you. Okay, where is... Safe house. Oh, this is oh oh yeah of course the free fire zone. What's that mean? It's technically, if you look at the map, yeah, you've got 
the five main, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, yeah, the five main regions of Mars, but you also have the free fire zone, okay. which you see it's got 300 control and only one mission. Okay, yeah. That one mi and that one mi doing that one mission removes the 300 control, however, that's a specific story part mission, not one you can just go and do. So you can't just do it yet? Yeah, basically, um, later on, a betrayal happens. Okay. And afterward, and then then you need to go looking for people for, for new allies. Okay. And then after that, you come up with a plan to get through the free fire zone that basically involves capturing an EDF guy and torturing him. Nice. However, the guy in question has tortured people, and the person doing the torturing is one of his victims. Ah, oh, fair enough. So, well, not not quite fair enough. But more kind of contribution. Yes, as I suppose would be the best term. Uh, but until that point, where he basically says, "No, there's blind spots in the artillery coverage." Yeah. You can't go there. You drive in, you start getting shot at, you die. Ah, oh, so serious. So it's uh, basically like um, in one Grand Theft Auto where you go. I think it's at one island. You can't go look like in, very in, fair. Yeah, in one of the PlayStation GTA's. You try crossing the bridge and, the, and you immediately get the five star wanted level. Yeah. Yeah, it's like that, only even more. Yeah. Oh yeah, you were saying about th vehicles going rusty. Oh. This is what a rusty vehicle looks like on Mars. F fair enough. Actually, uh, give me my hammer. I'll beat on this and get some salvage. It's odd, normal cars, you know, you beat on them, they Nothing. just blow up. EDF cars, you beat on them. They blow up, you get salvage. The rusty wrecks, yeah. you beat on them, you get salvage. Well, I'm assuming that they've already blown up. Yeah. And if oh, you are kidding me. What? Cost 200. Amount currently in possession. Oh, literally two off. Yep, yeah, okay, so this. I need to find another rusty car. There's one. That's better. Uh, Give me the armor. Rocket launcher costs 450. You have five. <laughs> yes. Well, after about that, we're just about out of time. I mean, well, we've got yeah. a few more minutes. So. Yeah. In that case, I'll just quickly go restock we my weapons. I don't have enough time to do another, uh, mm. do another mission. Yeah. Which is a pity. Because it's my favourite vehicle in the entire Southern game. That's the one that looks like the one from, one, one from Jack Free. It's literally yeah. just a, 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 a dune buggy with a, with a gun on it. Yeah, the only problem with this vehicle that I've ever found... Yeah. ...you can't carry passengers. Well, so it's useless enough. for There's rescue... Not a lot exactly it's cases, useless for it? rescue missions and what have you, but it's great for driving around because you can literally just do this. Like, like I said, it's literally a dune buggy with a turret. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, here's the wind farm. I was saying about. Oh yeah. Well, while it loads in. And while I'm driving through it, I'll get a notification on the radio. Here we are. High importance target located. And... Is it on my map? Come on, show me the high importance target. Oh, it should be somewhere around there. Because you see, these are all medium importance. Medium importance, and you just have one that says high. Yeah, there should be a high one, a high importance one, and it's a different shape. It's a, it's a larger uh, hexagon with a st with a moon underneath the star. Okay. Or sort of crescent underneath the star, rather. Oh well. Like I said we're just about out of time now. Anyway. Yeah. Okay. In that case, let me just go ramp this off something. Anyway, I've been Gun Games. I'm Rewind. And this has been Red Faction Guerrilla Remastered Edition. Yep. Okay. Um, bye bye. Bye bye.